All right, D, what do we got? The amazing COZ distiller machine. COZ. COZ. Is that Z? Depends where you're from. Tomato, tomato. Sure. And uh, what, what's so cool about this distiller? It takes out all the shit from our water system and gives the cleanest, healthiest water possible. But, 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 but we live in BC, Canada. Our water's clean. Look, you can oh, even see it. Oh, man. You gotta look at the stuff that's coming from the machine. Look how clean that looks, though. I know. I mean, from look. BC. Let's, from BC. Look at this. We'll fill up with water. Fill up a cup. Look how clean that is. What do you mean distilled water? How could it be better than that? Wait till you see what is in here. Then you will never want to drink tap water again and only distilled water. So what's crazy is we filled this up four times over the past three days. And it makes a gallon each time. And what happens is you fill it up with water and then it boils the water. And then the steam gets captured and drops out here. And this is, where we, this is the water we drink. And what's left is what's left after the steam comes out, which is just the sediment, which is the crud that you actually wouldn't believe is actually in the, the water. So we're going to show you what's left over after distilling four gallons of water, which isn't a lot of water. I mean, we drink about a gallon every day, right? Yeah. So over the course of three, four days, this is what we would have been consuming had we drank normal tap water, which is what we normally did for like 30 years of our life, right? 30 years of our life, we drank tap water, thinking it was totally fine. And now it's not fine. And now once we and see this, we real realize deal. we know the real deal. So show us what's inside. And we'll pour it into the glass for them to see it, actually. This is, uh, it's hard to believe. It's hard to believe. Right. Go for it. That is in four gallons of tap water. Now, you would never just grab this cup right now and drink it. That's disgusting. And yet, if you're drinking tap water, you are drinking that. It smells. Boy, you might like the smell, actually. I actually do like the smell, but I do not want to drink that. No way. So, this tap water, I mean, it's fine to brush your teeth with. It's fine to shower with because that stuff is pretty diluted, but still, like... When it's not diluted and you see what you're really getting, it's quite gnarly. So that's that. Ugh. Look at that. Look at that. It's like almost like oil in there. Mud water. Mud water. Now, like mud water. what they found in here is um, trace amounts of pharmaceuticals and trace amounts of feces and again in very small amounts it's like you're not going to notice it right away but over the course of many many years it's no wonder people have so many health issues so a lot of people who start drinking distilled water which is pure water I don't have an example to show you because we drank it all but what many people find is that um, a lot of their health symptoms go away no longer have joint pain no longer have ADD no longer have uh, side effects that come from having things like a, what's that issue a lot of kids have? Autism. Autism. Autism, yeah. Yeah, you can just go on any YouTube, popular YouTube video talking about distilled water and go look at the comment section and they'll say how parents will be commenting below saying how distilled water helped their kid with autism. Well, it's no wonder. Look at what the kid was drinking. That's why I immediately bought a distilled, or a distilled machine. A distillery? Distilled. Distillery. <laughs> distillery. Distillery. So as soon as you saw that, you went and bought one? Yeah. The same one, right? So easy. Just buy it online. Buy it on, you fill it up with water and plug it in. Done. No setup required. All right, that's that. Peace out. Adios.